day. So you know what I love doing? Break dancing. Look, man, it's the one. That's not break dancing. I'm a beaker. It's not break dancing. But more than that, when I'm walking with somebody and then this problem comes up. I actually think this way is the quicker way. I think you're going the long way. Uh, I think you know how to read a map. Yeah, you know what? How about I go this way and you go that way and we'll see who gets there faster. Hey, Nat. No running, yeah? Like I'm gonna run. I obviously know my way is faster. And then I run. And I know that's cheating and stuff, but I mean, I never ever got to win things as a kid, so I always try and win these things. Win! Google Maps, took your time. I made you this origami swan, 36 volts. Although the truth is I'm actually a lot more unfit than that, so it goes down something like this. It's immature, but it's just something I've never grown out of. Like 3D magic eye. Oh, it's there's no picture on this one. Or how I always giggle when I see the word sex. <laughs> he said sex in our IM chat. It's the third time someone's ever written sex to me. But yeah, I always get really excited when a friend challenges me to find a quicker path. It's like, huh, I can win this one. Although to be fair, that scenario only happens about once every two years. So about as regular as when this happens. Oh, it's a bear. Yeah, I rock at 3D Magic Eye. Ladies, get in line. I put it in my online profile. No, I've also been online, by the way, in Buenos Aires, and it has been amazing. I've been consuming more cows than McDonald's and seeing some really interesting mullet action. And if you'd like to find out more about my time in Buenos Aires, you should check out the Learning Planet page I've linked in the description. You can watch the new video, read the blog, and see the pictures there. In the meantime, don't forget to thumb me. Let me know if you uh, ever do any kind of sneaky things to beat your friends, and I will see you guys in a couple of days. But I will beat you there. Yeah. See ya. Okay, it's porno music slash comment time and top Yugi, I understand how you feel. I'm married to seven men and three women and all of them have been amazing in bed and they don't even know I exist. And I'm a little bit scared by how many of you solve problems with pineapples. When I asked for cures, I didn't realize pineapples would feature so heavily. Although at least you're not like this poor person who asked someone called Uncle Pablo to take away their hiccups. Do you need help, Toaster Girl? Have you been kidnapped by Uncle Pablo? Does Uncle Pablo touch you? And hells yeah I am, but hey, if the pirates stop paying me, I'd stop being one. Bam. How's that for an answer?